Hello and welcome back to the Mobius Archives. This is your host, Mobius Rex, and we are playing oh. Feed Yes Moo. Feed the Beast Unleashed. And oh boy. If I don't take my eyes off of it, we might actually be able to get a butterfly. Oh come on. Ha ha! So that's how you do it. I don't know if I needed to use the scoop, oh. but the first butterfly that I saw, I just could not capture. There we go. Citrus Swallowtail. What to do with a butterfly? I have absolutely no idea. But I'm going to go inside. And I better take that off my bar just in case something unusual happens. Uh... We have our guest room. It's fully sealed. And can I put it on a wall on the floor? Can I just let it go? Uh, that doesn't it doesn't bode well. Let's see. What can we do? Uh, I've got a whole bunch of stuff in my packs because I've been well, I've been trying to prepare for this episode. And uh, wasn't prepared to see a butterfly in the sky. So what I am going to do... So I'm going to try to make shelving. If I can actually remember how to do that. Uh, oops. Let's see. Shelf. And it's wood slabs and a wood plank. Okay, we can do that. Easy peasy. There we go. Just get that out of there. And right here. And it looks a bit weird. But well, that'll do for our first butterfly. I think what I'm going to have to do is to research uh, what I can do with these butterflies. Oh, it's getting night to me now. Uh, I'm going to go downstairs, dump off a load of stuff, and yeah. This is just basically one of my stuff chests. I want that. Uh, just leaving a whole bunch of stuff that I don't need at the moment. Uh, wool. Don't need wool. Don't need that. And just get all the rest of that. So I've been working... Yeah. Indeed. Uh, I've been working at getting our village set up. Now we have all this stuff as well. Yeah, I've been working on getting our village set up. And just off camera, just trying to get some more uh some more buildings set up. Uh getting a couple more things going. And that that uh butterfly quite surprised me. So now let's just take a look at what we were doing. Uh out here, I've been working on my own private arboretum. I thought that was like a skeleton or probably a creeper or something like that. But I've moved some of these bees and uh, started working on building our own arboretum. As you can see, I have a beech tree. Beech, birch, beech, I think it's beech. Uh, I have a beech tree here. Here. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I went to that. Uh, to, uh... And I'm getting hungry. Uh, to just to grow into our next oh, what did I do? Hmm. Didn't switch that. Uh grow to into our next tree. Uh it's gonna take a while because these obviously need time to grow. So this episode, I think what we're going to do take a quick review of this arboretum. Oh, look at that. We've got something. Nothing. Uh, we've got a few more spots where there's mutations. Or potential mutations, mutated leaves, crossbred leaves, or whatever we really want to call them. 
and whoops, whoops. Yeah, there's one right here as well. I'm not being as uh, cautious with these as I have been in the past because I'm just getting, getting way too many trees. Like this place is crowded out right now. Um, yeah, so I want to do, that's good, a little bit more exploring. Uh, not here. This is my quarry, if you've never seen it before. Oh, and I just fell in it. So this is quarried stone, this white stone here. Uh, it looks nice. Uh, that, I've been using it for mostly my house. Uh, is it, that's the moss reed down there. It's a hole right there. We've got big ass hole down there. And quite damaged armor. Oh, where's my... I have a good supply of arrows. That's fine. Um, yeah, so these cave systems. I didn't dig that out. A uh, bit dangerous. I explored them a little bit. Just enough to grab um, some moss, some new minerals. And as you can see, I'm quite lost. I think it's back here. Here? Might be something here. I hear a bat. Uh, that we have left to explore. I think that's uranium. I, I'm going to leave that uh, here until later. And I think we have a little bit of exploration to do around here. Because... I think this is a ravine. Look at that. Ooh. Yeah, I definitely have gone around the corner and seen a little bit of this. I hear those bats and that's going to be a bit annoying, but uh, what I want to do is explore down there today. Our best bet is to use some of this precious, precious cobblestone. Oh, without getting rid of our pick or anything. Uh, because this is a natural cave, we don't need to uh, ensure that... Ooh, don't want to go that far. Uh, that everything's braced. It's only where you actually dig a good mine down into the ground. But I need to make sure this area is pretty much safe. Gonna have to go down there and get that now. Which was my intention, right? Alright, so I'm gonna build a slight stair going down this way. I've decided for the most part I am going to leave um, minerals and walls for the most part uh, while we're exploring. And pick them up later. Oh, I can't climb that? Damn moss. I did expect to climb moss, right? No, I guess he wouldn't. But apparently I can, I can cut straight through it. There, a little bit more ore berries for my ore berry farm. I'm looking up a lot because I'm expecting to see quite a few mobs out there. It's daylight. This is dark. So you'd expect there to be mobs in the area. I'm going to I'm going to just block that off. And put a torch up high. One of the things I don't want to happen is to have a creeper drop down on me with my armor as it is. I expect any creeper encounter to end up with me A, dead, and B, without everything I have collected with me. Now those claws are from bats, uh, I've discovered. Kill a bat, they... Oh, come on. Uh, they uh, leave these claws behind now. Oh, this is scary. Because there's so much I can't see. What was that? Why did I put, just pick up something? 
Maybe it was another claw. I don't get it. Well, I do have that. Huh. Okay. Just adding a little bit more light here. Don't really trust the area. Like down there. Eat while we can. I don't need this on my bar either. Okay. Up there, dangerous. Across there, dangerous. But I think I'll go across here. I'll light a torch up here. Hopefully, well, up there, also dangerous. Hopefully, pushing back spawning of any mobs. How far are we? Can only go down to level 30 in this version or in this uh in this state of the mod of the mod the um the challenge it's gonna be a little careful it's been too quiet never say those words too quiet is bad Okay, we're alive. Whoa! Mostly alive. Um, let's go this way first. Just want to make sure what's behind me is okay. And yeah, it is. Nothing should be able to spawn there. I'm just going to move the torch one further in. Yeah, that should all be okay. Down here now. What does the depth of this hold? Definitely a bat. Um, shovel. We're a bit on edge, because like I've said, I have... Oh, okay, nothing. Nothing. Oh, no, something. Like I said... See? Claws. Uh, like I said, I've turned on Creeper Collateral, which means any death, I lose I hear a skeleton. Not sure what direction it's coming from. Ooh, I didn't even notice that hole above me there. So, I heard a skeleton, which means something's nearby. Okay, we cleared out this area safe skeleton is nearby not sure where it is but this area in general safe all right it might actually be on other sides of this uh sink that we got from uh the collapse of that uh, gravel there now skeleton right Skeleton should be nearby, still. So we have to be careful. Oh, where's the other path? I went that way, right? Okay, nothing that way. For the most part, despite the fact I am hearing a lot of spiders having issue. Okay, let's pause here and figure out is it in here i'm looking for oh i might must not have i don't think i've tapped uh enough uh rubber trees to make a sufficient amount of torches with uh or to give us uh enough rubber to make any torches right now Okay. I'll approach this obliquely. So down there, that's an issue. We don't know what's down here. Uh, put a torch there just to keep it lit and keep stuff from spawning there. Just being a little careful, a little cautious. Just don't want to be snuck up on by a creeper. Creepy creepers. 
and I don't want to. Thought I heard something. I don't want to give them a chance to blow up. Okay, nothing. Whew. Okay, which way? Which way? All right, so tin or berry there. Skeleton. Okay. I can outshoot this guy. Or not. Ow. All right. Whew, we took him down. Crap. Is there really one there? I see it. Did not see me. To be careful about. This is not safe. Um. Crap. 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 Who? Okay, we're out of the very. You can't really justify going deeper. Because we're at 32 right now. We really don't want to... Uh, uh, scary music. We don't... Oops. Don't want that there. Uh, we don't want to go further down. So up is our only true choice at the moment. Oh, come on. Don't do that. So we can't go down there because that goes below 30. <laughs> We'll just make this place as light as possible. Hey, look, hole. What are we at? 34, okay. Makes this place as light as possible. And don't go down any farther if you don't have to. Okay, that's gonna make it a defensible area. Nothing can go uh, down there. This, on the other hand, pain in the ass. What shall we do? Okay, we have that cave system back there to explore. And this goes down too deep. Uh, 34, 33, 32, 31. And that's 30 down here, right? Yeah, so I don't wanna go below here. So even though I see a dead end, what we'll do just make sure no mobs can get out at us. They can't go up too high for the most part. Uh, at least creepers can't, and that's the mob that I am most concerned with most of the time. All right, let's check to see what's back here. Treasure, like to see a spawner, but oh, I should not have done that. Nope, that's just, uh, that's just nothing. All right, so this cave, lots of minerals, pretty safe. Uh, how should I do this? Yeah. I'll just try to make that safe so that mobs don't spawn. Uh, just bring the light level up a little bit. So now I hear another skeleton. Not sure what direction it's coming from. We'll go this way. See light up there. Okay, we're back down below uh, where we got in from, which is okay. I see a creeper down there. And I should not have turned my back to these walls. Ooh, I hear that skeleton nearby. Oops, how'd that happen? Wow, that's weird. I haven't seen that before. Putting a torch in the same corner is allowed. Okay, that skeleton's right nearby. To my left? Probably. No. Okay. Huh. Skeleton's hidden. Not sure where it's coming from. Maybe it's up here. Nothing. 
All right. No, well, that's safe. Where's that skeleton then? Might be down there. I hear it. It's like it's so close. What level are we on? 34, 33, 32, 31. And that's a beehive. What do we got down here? This is 30. Yes, I stopped, stepped on 29. I know I shouldn't have. It's also very dangerous for me because I do not have iron armor. And so anything down here is really quite dangerous. I hear a slime and a skeleton. Oh, that's going to drive me nuts. Uh, let's dig up here. Oh, even more caves. Let's see where they go. Nothing. Okay, good. Well, we survived yet another exploration. Uh, mobs are down there. I expect something here because I can hear it, right? Let's see. I expect something here to leave it, lead out onto a cave. I'm just going to chase this diagonally. See if we hear anything. Like, that skeleton is really loud. Okay. Nothing... Oh, wait. I'm supposed to be protecting myself. Well, anyways. Put a wood bracer. Come on. Where is that? Alright. No natural cave system there. I'm going to step back so that we don't get a cave in. Let me dig back this area. Because this has potential. Potential, but no dice. Okay. All right. Well, that's a that's blown. That skeleton's gonna drive me nuts. So is that bat. Jeez. Here's a zombie. We know there's some stuff down. But that's fine. Lava. So, nothing too terrible out this way. And I think that back down that away, there was that dead end with the waterfall. So I'm just going to pick through here and see. Well, let's see what's going on. Small room, sure. But I see sand here. Sand usually means ocean. So that means this is under the ocean. Under the sea. Ooh, what's this? Oh, this is also under the ocean. Oh, yeah. <sighs> okay, not prepared for ocean voyage. But let's go see where this pops us out. Leaving the torch for light. And upwards. I hear lava. Do you hear lava? I hear lava. I heard lava. Right, running out of air, running out of air. <gasps> Whew. Ah, what's that? Oh, spider. Okay, a uh, skeleton. Hmm. Hmm. Backing away. Don't like the creeper either. Say so, hello. Oh, this is actually. Hey, it's morning. Uh, this is where we spawned. Out that way somewhere, I think. Yes. Yes, it is. And we live th this way now. Okay. Well, that tells us a little bit about what's going on. Whew. Creepers. Just gotta avoid them. Let's get back within our territory. So. Yeah, like I said, we've been building our arboretum. Whew. Exploring underground. Uh, that was exciting. 
at least for me, uh, because it was a bit uh, nerve wracking knowing that I was going in there, under there. Whew, not having too significant armor. I mean, leather armor's all right. It's all damaged, but leather armor's all, all right. Um, let's eat in my safe house. Oops, oh, I just put all my carrots on that shelf. Let me put this stuff back. There you go. Wooden sword. Ha ha. Um, yeah. So, I think we'll call that it for today. Thank you very much for watching. This has been Moby's Rex for the Moby's Archives. Have a good day. And a wonderful night. Bye-bye.